really kind of need to defend yourself here because because <laughs> Rick Bunchy was here and he didn't say anything really really bad, but Byron Reggins did, and we, uh, we were would, asking them. Oh, I would expect that of Byron. He's always been jealous of me. And Byron, this is for you. You're just gonna have to get over it. I got the hair, I got the teeth, I got the skin, I got the physique. So. He's I'm just letting moves. you know. He's got moves like Jagger. <laughs> <laughs> Jagger. <laughs> oh, no, your daughter's going to hate it that we said that. Yeah, yeah, well, that's okay. My, my nephew writes for Maroon 5, so he has several songs out by them. So I'm, and I'm, I'm hip to that. You have uh, a relative still currently on The Voice? He's currently on The Voice, yeah, Justin Hopkins. Uh, if you go to iTunes, he, he released a song this week. It's a really great song. Not that I'm biased, but it's called Love on the Radio. And it's a very cool song, but he writes for O. Oh, Keith Urban and Seal and a number of yeah. others. But who's uh, who's his coach? Own. Who's his coach on the voice? Is it CeeLo? It or? is CeeLo. CeeLo chose him. CeeLo chose him. So oh, I guess I'm. What's that? I'm one degree of separation from CeeLo. <laughs> wow! <laughs> Just don't get a cat. No, no. <laughs> we don't want you to get a cat. No, but uh, but that's that's part of the breadth of the conference. Uh, and I may have I may have Justin next year. We'll just see. Not to be a name dropper, but a, an acquaintance, kind of a friend of mine, because we restore old cars and whatnot. Is Jerry Seinfeld, and Jerry was in town about a month and a half ago, and he did a great job. He had about 2,500 people at his comedy show, and he was on TV all the time and on the radio and in the Seattle Times promoting it, etc. Last night we had just over 4,000 for Tim Hawkins. No TV, no radio. It was on our website and announced in our mailing. And then Overlake put it on their calendar, and uh, we had uh, almost twice as many as Jerry did. So that's just unbelievable. Yeah, the it was people. Unbelievable. Who, yeah, it was uh, the place was rocking, yeah, yeah, totally. and it was uh, you know just one of those things. And that's that's a testament to uh, the people who come here. And uh, Tim's a quality guy, and the other comedians. And today we have Barnes and Minor. Mm -hmm. Well, they've been on national TV 25 times, and the Comedy Central, and on and on it goes. So we're going to have a great time with them this afternoon.